Hey, what is going on everybody? It's Poodle back and today we got our weekly rewards and I'm excited to get into this But I'm not entirely sure how much of the packs I will be taking just because of if you look at my coin count some um, Dumb things were done. I might have overextended my luck on those team of the year nap packs I should have stopped after my Todd Gurley. I got home from my girlfriend's house at around 5 a.m And I got home and I was kind of out awake and in a good mood and I was like, you know what? Maybe I should just go with the packs, and I got on just to literally do the packs, and I lost about a million coins. I did get some quick sell training, but let's get into this and see how much money I can make back. I'm going to try some of the packs and see how this goes, so quick sell these. Here are my packs, and you know, some good news, actually. So, I just purchased my first camera in my life, actually. No, what's it called right now? It just got in, just got shipped to my house. Well, actually, I was too impatient to wait for it to ship, so I just drove to my local post office, and I just picked it up myself personally, and I'm really excited. It's a Canon M50. It's supposed to be a great camera. It records in 4K, so I will be ditching this Logitech uh, 920 already. It wasn't a bad camera, as you guys can see. It's not a horrible quality. Oh, I backed out, but I will be making the switch. Let me get back into these packs. Okay, so like I was saying, the M50 will be able to record in 4K quality, which is pretty substantial. I don't know how many people are going to be able to see that at the moment, but 4K is the future of videos and everything. Like my monitors that I currently record on are 4K, and my Xbox is 4K, and everything I have in my room for the most part is 4K. My TV is 4K. So that is the future. I might be ahead of the trend than more, more so than most people, but soon the standard, the, like the, the regular standard, is going to be 4K which will be exactly what everyone needs. So right now it might not be useful, but I'm trying to future-proof my setup. That's the goal at least. So I hope this will be useful at some point. Why is it opening this pack? And I actually want to show you guys this camera footage, but I don't have it set up yet. I have to go buy a memory card actually because apparently it doesn't come with one and some other stuff. But when I got everything done, I want to show it all to you guys. So I'll be, I'll be opening some of these red zone. I'll open up a red zone pack, see how it goes. But so I'll be opening up um the camera later today i'm gonna be setting it up and then i want to compare and contrast the video quality over this channel so i'm gonna, I'm just gonna side by side probably show you the logitech versus the camera to show you how, how it is and then i play i have a lot of things in store for this camera actually i have things that are coming up vacations in a few months that i'd like to probably vlog on this channel show you guys where i'm at maybe even oh i have something really cool actually to show everyone uh let me get that real quick before i continue these packs okay so as you guys can see if i can get this into focus I bought this cool thing where I have a clip on my phone and I also have my thing connected. Look, this is, I'm literally playing Madden. How cool is that? The The software itself is pretty cool. It's called OneCast. It's like 10 bucks and the clip cost me like 8 bucks on Amazon. So it's perfect because when I'm right over there in the mornings, I wake up. I'm not ready to record. I lay down, play some Madden from my bed, do some pack opening. Look, the latency is not bad. There's really no latency. Look, watch. It's almost instantaneously. So, I mean, for anyone who has a smartphone, I mean, it's pretty much pretty, pretty awesome, to be honest. And at the moment, the developers haven't exactly been at a point where they can do it out of the house yet. But it's pretty cool. Like, you know, you're out of fa your family's all over for, like, Thanksgiving or something. And, you know, at that point where it's, like, the night's kind of settled down. And you kind of just want to wind off on the couch. But, you know, you can't be in your room because it's kind of kind of rude. You bring this right out there. You just chill on this. You play. You're at your friend's house. And, you know, everyone's in the living room all talking. You bring this to you. You're just playing, like... You can use on their Xbox, bring your own Xbox. But the point is, you don't have to be locked in the room. You ever had people over and you just you want to go in your room and lock yourself, but that's but oh, knocked my mic. But you know that's rude. So you gotta you gotta bring this out. You don't want to feel detached from it once you bring this out. Though this is the perfect thing. I personally love it for for everyone. Just letting you know, it's a good recommendation. Twenty bucks for solo challenges. Imagine how you know you don't want to get up and go to your setup, play some solos. You don't want to be in a chair. Imagine being under your warm comforters, laying in bed, and just chilling on this, and playing all your solo challenges. I, I'm excited for when I start, when I grind out some, when there's some new solos to grind out, I will be laying in my bed, sitting on this, and I will be playing under my warm comforters with some TV going and everything. Like, this is the perfect thing for solos. You know what? I, when you gotta go to the bathroom, you, know, you gotta sit down for a little bit, take your time in there, you bring your Madden with you. You're in the middle of a, you're in the middle of a Madden game, make the switch, pause the game, make the switch real quick. You're in the bathroom, you already gotta go eat. You're, you know, people come home with food, people bring home food, you know, your girlfriend, your wife, your mother, whatever. You play some of this. I, and this is this is no this is not me endorsing anything. It's just I'm personally excited to have this thing. So, yeah, these are some big changes I've been making today. So I got my camera in this. So 
I cannot wait to record in that camera. There's just a lot involved with it. Um, if you didn't hear before, it's a Canon M50. Look into it if you like what I'm saying. It's a really, really good camera. I'm, I'm using this whole camera type of everything, so I don't know what I'm doing, pretty, to be honest. I know about everything else, but camera's not my not my forte. So let me get back into this pack opening, actually. Let me run this pack from, from, from my little thing right here. Oh, ultimate freeze. Ah, put the volume down on this, actually. All right, we got... We got Cyrus. All right, this pack was not good. I'll do one more. Let's hope for a team of the year. And that's about all we can do. So this is cool, right? I can go lay in my bed right now and play on this thing. I actually, I think I sent this out to almost everyone I knew the day I got it. Like I just had to let everyone know that I got this thing. It's so cheap and no one, no one on Xbox really knows about it for some reason. Wow, 77 for that big animation. Yeah, these, these weekend league rewards are something else, man. I'm telling you. All right, this will definitely be my 75K. Cause I got to get that coin count back up. And then I'll show you guys my John Madden progression. Also, quick question. If I started a franchise series where I rebuild the Giants and I get rid of Trash Eli or whatever team you guys want to see, preferably the Giants, would you guys watch that? That was just a question I was wondering. I was thinking, what if I do a, do a Giants franchise? You know, I'll import the actual rookies from this year. And then I will actually run a series with the Giants, do a few seasons of it, because we're at that point, I started my YouTube channel late, so I mean, it was bound to happen, where I'm at that point already, where Madden's starting to slow down a little bit, especially Ultimate Team, so maybe if I can mix in some Ultimate Team, and the franchise with the days that it gets slower, I was wondering what you guys would think about that, I think it's a good idea, run a, run a Giants franchise, rebuild them, and I'll set like schedule, like the days that I play it, especially the days when content's slow, and then com couple that with Weekend League, some gameplays, or any other series. If you guys like anything that you have in mind, just comment down below the series that you'd like to see. I want to get, get some series going, something that I could I could brand to my channel that I've, you know, because I'm, I'm, this is new. I haven't started anything that you guys are familiar with. So I think that'd be cool. Get a little little community going with that. And let me open up these series trophies, actually. Now let me stop stalling that. So yeah, let me know. I think that'd be really cool. And then I can't wait to do all that. I'd also like to start live streaming Madden at some point, but, you know, I feel like my fan base is too slow, too low for that right now. I don't know how many people will come out and see that. But for real, everyone start following me on Twitter. Start following me on Twitter so that we can start getting a community going. I can. I already have a few followers on there. I got a pretty decent... Honestly, for YouTube, not too bad. I'm doing okay my first week. And to be honest, this is more of like a vlog video. Now that I mention it, I should probably full screen the camera, to be honest. This was more of just a background, some background Madden, just to let you guys know where I'm at already. So about two weeks in. Not doing too bad, um... But Madden's already at the slower point, so I feel like that's going to make my channel at a little slower growth rate. So I want to create some excitement, so I'm definitely looking to connect the franchise. All right, so adding to my John Madden, it's 11 more in the set. Got to finish another season so that I can get all this done. And let's see, we're at 11. I believe we're at, what, 53, so we should be at 64. If I looked at it right, we got left. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35. 36 left, really? Oh, wow, I'm dumb. There's a progress bar in the corner. All right. So we're done with that. The team's looking the same. Still waiting for some new content. And if you guys want to know what this clip is and all this other stuff is, just comment down below. I said it was one cast, and I'll, I'll put a link down there if you guys want it at some point. Just let me know. So that's about it for this video. Rem remember to comment below for the series you guys like to see. If you'd like to think the Connect the Franchise is a good idea. And whether or not I should commentate the whole game, or would you like me to edit the whole game? Like, how do you want to see it? Like, a full game? How many quarters? Would you like me to edit parts out? Like, what exactly do you want to see? So that's it. Please make sure to follow me on Twitter so we can get this community growing. Thank you so much for watching. I'm out. Make sure to comment, like, and subscribe. See you later.